Hi, so Igna that bit. Yeah, anyway, ignore that. Um, so today is a Monday, I believe it's the 5th of September. Um, and yes, I haven't vlogged in like donkeys. I really need to sort that out. Um, I haven't vlogged since like, oh, <laughs> I don't know, like in like ages, and I mean like ages like since the 31st, or is it 30th? Pretty sure that either the 30th or the 31st of um, August, I've not vlogged. Um, and yes, I do have some explaining to do. Basically, I haven't vlogged for that amount of time because, let me just set you up. Um, we got home from Blackpool and then I didn't bother vlogging because, like, I, I, I vlogged on the last day, which is uploaded. And then... We went to Scarborough the following day, so Sunday, and I vlogged that, and I was uploading it, and uh, like I said, like, I was way behind in my vlogs, I was uploading it and everything like that, and then all of a sudden, like, my movie maker would just not save any um, video, it would just kept saying there was an error, not enough storage, everything like that. I'm like, oh my god. And then from Scarborough, um, it was just like a hectic week. We had appointments to go to. I was looking after my great nanan. Um, I was going down to my nanan's nearly every day. And it just went overboard. And then September came. And that just went mental. And from Friday which I don't know what date that was, so I'm gone. Um, Sunday, Saturday, Friday. So that was the uh, 2nd of September. Um, my mum came down with something um, Thursday night and she just said that she had that aches everywhere in the body and she felt that a cold was coming on or a flu type thing was coming on. And she just left it at that, and then Friday morning she got up and she had diarrhea, and she, because of all of her conditions, um, she uh, has a very low immune system, and what that is, if you don't know what an immune system is, is where if you come down with something like any illness whatsoever, if it can be like a cold or diarrhea or whatever illness you come down with um that like fights it and it, well you, you you still get it but you're just not as ill you like you fight it so that fights the cells that fight the infection um but because mum has got heart failure and me and just a list of things <laughs> um the uh, immune system is very very low and you couldn't fight the Nurse and diarrhea, or the stomach bug. Um, so she's had diarrhea since Friday. Um, yesterday she had to go up to hospital because um, she was just not well. Like literally, uh, diarrhea was just getting worse. She felt sick. Uh, she was complaining of really bad, like abdominal pain or stomach pain. If you didn't know what abdominal is. Um, like all, oh, if you can really see, or like down here and the bottom, like not a bottom, but the bottom of the stomach. Um, so she went to the hospital with Richard. I went down to my nanan's, um, to just stay there because it was like company and I had somebody there to help stuff and have my dinner and everything like that. Um, and she came back home, like she had to kind of. Look, Canella in, in the like, in like the arm, like somewhere around here, um, and that was just in case she had to be put on a drip because she was very, very dazed. Like she was just weren't with it. Like she was, 
I'd say she was alert, like she was awake and stuff, so she wasn't unresponsive, but she just wasn't, he, like, her mind wasn't here, if you get what I mean. So, like I said, Richard took her to hospital, they went around, uh, they went in the morning, actually, they went around, like, 10.40, maybe, and we leave until, like, 3, just after 3, um, and basically she had a cannula, um, they kept the fluids up and everything like that because she was very dehydrated because when you've got sickness and diarrhea or stomach bug or any illness except cold you can't really eat and drink because you feel that sick you don't want anything so that's what my mum's been like um and yeah all in all <laughs> today um she is still very very dizzy um, she's not on the planet. I mean, she, she, you can have a conversation with her. And she can have one back, but like, a man's not there. But, um, she hasn't been to to the toilet since got up this morning, which was like half nine, and it's now because <coughs> me, and twenty past two, and she has not been to the toilet for. <laughs> A number two. <laughs> so, I think she's getting better. Um, but she's still very, very ill. Like, she like feels yuck, and she feels she feels she's been feeling sick since Friday. She hasn't been sick, but she's tried to be sick. She just hasn't anything come out. Um, she just feels it. She's just very, very delicate. So that's why I haven't really been vlogging because like I'm looking after my mum nearly 24 7 24 7 um, except when she's asleep because Richard's here but yeah we've just been working non-stop and it's just been hectic so that's why I haven't uploaded so I'm just gonna like not even upload except for this um, video just because like yeah that's the only one I've really done is today um, from today I'm going to vlog again I'm just really really sorry for not vlogging um, I really hope you guys do understand my situation but I can't really vlog anything when I'm constantly just in the same spot all day and literally I've not been out except to my nana so that's the only thing I've been out I haven't been to town I haven't been anywhere I haven't been to bed well I haven't been anywhere in the world except this house and my nana so that's the only place I've been um, I start um, college, um, I did touch it up in a vlog but like I said I obviously I didn't record the vlog, uh, I didn't upload it so basically um, this is going to be a really long video but um, basically my mum wants to do a course um, because now she's not working and we don't know when she's going to get back she really wants to do like a course to like keep her work apart so she's not bored um, and so we went to Barnsley College just for my mum and I I have never planned um, when I left school I always said oh, yeah, I really want to go to college because that's what you do you either go to college or you go to university um, or you get a job um, so job and university was out of the picture because a university is in my mind for brainy people who's got m more GCSE grades than me, better GCSE grades than me, and a job, um, I can't really have one of them because I said you need best grades and I didn't get the best grades and um, so I was like should I go to college, should I not and I didn't really want to go because I just didn't want to see the people like who I saw through school who bullied me like if I saw the people who didn't bully me, they just said hello to me, um, I, I'd be okay with that. But I was like, you know what, I really can't deal with going to college with everything what I've got as well. <laughs> well, not everything, I've only got two conditions, but um, with the conditions of what I got, sorry for the background noise, um, it's the dog next door. Um, so, I was like, I'm not going to go to college, so that's where life skills came, and yeah, I'm there. And then, so like I said, my mum wanted to go to college to do a course. She wanted to do a health 
care professions court or health care science something to do with healthcare anyway <laughs> and so she went and she's enrolled in that and she's she's okay she's starting she's starting college and um, she's not at Barnsley College she's actually at the university which is somewhere I ain't got a clue where that it is but and then I was like if my mum can do it then so can I and I was like you know what I'm not going to see the people who bullied me or didn't like me or anything like that I'm not going to see them so I may as well try and if it doesn't work out I don't know what but um I went into the business section because that's what I want to do I want to do business and um hello fly <laughs> and uh I was like you know what let's try so I went to business and it was just like all complicated like all these stuff I had to do like if a practical theory and I'm like you know what, well, I'll not go to college, I'll stick on my life skills. And then there was a maths and English section, and I'm like, okay, I need my maths and I need my English because I'm not very good at both subjects. So I went and enrolled in maths and English, and I'm doing a maths and English course at Eastgate, which is actually behind the Barnes and Chronicle. Um, I have never been in the building, so... <laughs> I start next Monday. I do Mondays and Thursdays. My mum does Tuesdays and Fridays. Pretty sure that is. And I'm still doing lab skills in the morning. And then I go straight into college. So I, I, like, I don't know why I'm still doing lab skills. But I guess it's kind of there as a backup in case like, I don't want to, to do a college anymore. So yeah. I think that's all I have to really tell you. I hope. Mm. I don't know. Uh, I believe that's it. What's all I have to tell you? Apart from that, I'm starting college next Friday. My mum's meant to be starting this Friday, actually. College. I start next Monday, to say. And my mum's meant to be starting this Friday, but I don't know if she's going to get. Hopefully, she's better. Um, I think she is on the road of recovery. Um. And that is it. I've really got it to back. How annoying. And that's it, I think. So I'm not going to vlog for the rest of today. Or whenever I upload this vlog. Which probably is going to be today. Um. So, yeah. What is my headband doing? Okay. So, I will see you tomorrow with a vlog. Um. And hopefully you it's going to be better than what I've been doing. So if you guys did enjoy this update video, please do give it a massive thumbs up and make sure you show your support. Comment down below any video suggestions or any comments you would like to. Subscribe if you are new. And yeah, oh, also before I go, um, What's with my voice? Basically, um, I did have a boyfriend, um, oh you guys probably no, I don't know if you did, if I told you. Um, I had a boyfriend, um, I had him around two and a half months, and yes, not yesterday. So, Saturday night, um, he broke up with me. Um, don't ask why, he didn't even have a reason, he just said we're over, and that way, so I blocked him on every social media, I blocked his friends on social media, because they just kept calling me and calling me and I'm just like, do you know what? I just come dealing with you, especially yesterday when my mum was in hospital. I, I just didn't like it. So, that's another update. Okay, I'm going to go now. Bye, see you tomorrow. I love you loads.